Okay, let's move on. Going on to number eight. Start. Thank you, darling. It's interesting how the truth can sometimes seem uh, might malleable, depending upon your point of view. Like how those dime novels make you out to be something you're not? Jack, don't be starting trouble. No, he's right. They do tend to exaggerate. Did they exaggerate your part in taking down the Daltons? Well, I was there in the flesh, boy, so I saw what happened firsthand. The Dalton brothers. Hell oh, yeah, man. Those Daltons were lawmen once, before they all went bad. Robin banks Brother, and trains clear across the territory. You got a mean spirit in ya. Coffeeville, of course. I was one of the citizens who took up arms that day. Fighting on the side of the right. Bill Powell. I did my best, Bob sir. Dalton. We all did. Grat Dalton. Those are strange names. Man. Man, I guess people didn't have that good of imagination with those names. Like, those are really weird names. Grat, G R A T. It was early morning. One of my friends was a local gunsmith, oh, and he yeah. handed out firearms to anybody who'd take one. You see, the Daltons got it in their heads to rob two banks at the same time. Two banks on the same damn street. <laughs> The story was Bob Dalton's girl was always writing him about how he had no ambition. Well, the locals recognized the Daltons right off. Before they could get away, oh, yeah. half the town took ass. up arms to defend their property. Oh yeah. The brothers paid dearly for their stupidity. But everybody knows. That's what inbreeding does. Had it coming. There's more to it than that. I read all about that day, so I know for a fact that it went down very differently. What? He was there. <laughs> it was high noon. <laughs> How do you Possibly know it went down US differently? The marshals were on the rooftop across the street. Get ready, boys. They're gonna make a move. The lawmen had been tracking the Daltons for months. Now they finally <laughs> had them dead to rights. Among them was a bounty hunter feared by many a lawbreaker. Shoot this man had no intention of letting the Dalton slip away. The marshals tried to get the Daltons to surrender. They'll give up eventually. We just gotta wait to sell the bitches out. This bounty hunter knew that the brothers were far too proud to ever lay down their guns. You ain't stopping me! This sounds like something you read in an A, uh government newspaper those one of the marshals shouted where are you going are you crazy yeah this definitely sounds like something you uh he paid him no that rifle's mine is that what he just said the back of the bank then he figured out how to hit the Daltons from a direction they weren't expecting from above Let's do this. A later, he was climbing up a steep ladder, laughing at danger as he did. Hardy, har har. I'm assuming that I'm playing the role Brave of this men guy. Like him who risked their lives to tame this wild hunt. <laughs> We've got company. Heroic men like him. Is that side of the other men could not of a wood to make this country free. Like Jim Bowie and Davy Crockett, who died defending the Alamo. By the way, if you haven't seen that uh movie, The Alamo, I recommend you go see it. It's really good. I used to watch the uh, TV show. The Disney TV show of Davy Crockett. That was such a good TV show. Davy Crockett, King of the Wild Frontier. Whoops. Nope. Missed it again. That Silas Greaves. What the hell? Blank, blank. 
came away By the way, I'm pretty sure there was like some special hidden thing over here. Oh yeah, no, 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 I'll show you. Back this way. After you come down the stairs, you go into the safe right here. In one of these saves is a uh, special hidden secret thing. And if I can get through this fucking fence. His name is Silas Greaves. And when the dust finally settles, Silas Greaves, man king of killing people. Sorry, kid, but that just <laughs> wasn't the way it happened. Oh man, everyone has their own version to every story. That's why it was in early science noon, not high noon. in uh the scientific field I was testimony um, was already up in arms. is actually up one of the lowest forms of proof. Like it's actually pretty much the lowest forms of proof. You can't Those just say deputies surrounding the bank you can't just say, Oh, the earth is round just because I said so. I saw it once. I, I've been around the whole earth. And I for sure think it's round. Oh. You have to have physical proof in the months. science community. Wait, Unlike uh, in so law friends. where... If you can have Finally, multiple people did. testify for Those something. stupid bastards decided to rob two banks at the same time in the what? same town where everybody knew them. So they still had what? coffee. What? Oh, I'm about to sneeze. Holy shit. Woo! Oh man, I just sneezed my brains out. Holy shit. Let me hit my O for objective. Ah, okay. Whoops, didn't mean to press that. Those friends came after me like a pack of wild dogs. Tooth and nail. They were coming at me from all directions. I caught sight of the Daltons running with the money and didn't want to lose it. Problem was, they knew the town better than I did. To top it off, I found myself in the middle of another shootout entirely. Did the Daltons pull up in somebody's house? No, it was the uh, Smiths, I believe. They were cousins of the Daltons, and they were shooting at the Browns, who were shooting at the Daltons. Which wasn't any surprise, because those two families have been feuding forever. And since the Joneses are related to the Browns, they shot at the Smiths, pissing off the Heimhoffers, whose daughter recently married a Smith. Well, what? bullets were flying every which way as all the old feuds in Kansas caught fire. Did anyone else them. think that made sense to them? Of pissed off people in coffee I think there is a uh, secret hidden thing up here somewhere. Sometimes. Probably in this room. Shit happens. Shit does happen, man. Shit does happen. As from the famous words of Forrest Gump. Shit happens. The Dalton boys knew I would never give what up. What happens? Shit. Those Daltons weren't the sharpest knives in the drawer, but they always stood together. They set a trap to slow me down and allow at least two of them to escape. The third brother stayed behind to plant me, just in case that trap of theirs didn't work. It was Emmett, the youngest. He decided to stand his ground Holy and shit. me down. Can you move you Earth? This is where it is for you. He was determined to protect his brothers. And I understood how he felt. Taking me on all by his lonesome wasn't exactly a recipe for a long life. It's hog killing time. I'm not here, man. I'm gonna tear you apart. Oh, yeah. But Dalton yeah. survived the robbery in Coffeeville. He's the only Dalton who did. 
They say he was shot 23 times. Well, Dwight, who do you think put all those damn holes in him? Meh. Ludicrous had game That's who. That boy had grit. So, it wasn't that hard to find these nuggets of truth. They were pretty, I don't know, man. Yeah, as you can tell, I found all three of them. Uh huh. Let's do another. That was eight, right? The Dalton brothers, yeah. So here we go, number nine. Yeah, man, number nine. And then we'll be all caught up with me. Sweet. You guys are amazing. I love ya. Thanks for staying with me through this difficult time. Where I've lost my recording. It took me a couple of days to track the Daltons down. They can't get away with this. Are those the Daltons? In that time, a whole posse of local vigilantes offered to lend a hand. So are they, uh, they seem vigilantes as determined as me or Daltons? Outlaws. But as we headed into those swamps, it was like I had my own private army. There was no way those boys were getting away this time. We'll see about that. It was early fall. As man. famous sports gone porn yeah. said. At least you had the shit weather happens. On your side. Not by my recollection. It was damp and foggy as hell. It was tough to stay on a true course. Hi guys. So we kept an eye out for landmarks. It was autumn. The maple trees were in full color. Red as blood. That looks a little orange to me. Get your color straight, color blind boy. So the whole area was flooded. The vigilantes had spread out wide, and pretty soon I couldn't see anybody. Bury them in the swamp. Where do they stand? Whoops. Except for some again. son of bitches ahead of me wanted to do me harm, so I had to face him alone. I wondered why my compatriots didn't come running when they heard the shots. Shit happens. <laughs> I can't get out of my get that out of my head anymore. Life is like a box of chocolates. Jenny. Yeah. Which way am I supposed to go? So oh, did you okay. find the Daltons? Not yet. But I did have the question for pleasure of meeting a few of their friends. Can't see. Oh my god. You know what? I'm shooting him in the balls. Bam! Fatal shot right there. Shot his dick off. Kills any grown man. If you do that, they're pretty much dead. established quite a reputation by that time, so they attracted all manner of Except for the, uh,. Bald guy in Game of Thrones. God damn it. Oh, camel. Oh, fuck me. They're throwing TNT. I caught it. There we go. Wow, that guy was annoying. He needs to be shot. Oh, wait. 
point B and I was under serious attack. And my reinforcements was nowhere to be seen. Oh, my actually has gone now to shit. But luckily, a barn materialized as it right before my eyes. I scrambled up top. Why does to it make me look view. at that stuff? I want to get the ammo. Okay. <sighs> Just ended up falling inside. So how did you? That was not dramatic. The barn doors was open. About right then, I saw some suspicious characters running through the bushes. Of course, I followed them. Oh my god, only got one that of them. That goddamn swamp was like a goddamn maze, and pretty soon I had no goddamn idea where I was. God damn it. Someone's sleeping. Steve? Go oh, Steve. So I just started walking, and pretty soon I... Oh. Yo, Steve! Wake the fuck up. Steve? Steve? Uh, huh? Oh, uh, no, 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 I'm listening. You better be. Indians surrounded me from all sides. What? Those damn Indians. They some wily. They were Indians? No. I just wanted to make sure Steve was paying attention. Now, where was I? You were following the Daltons through a swamp? Yeah, Steve, you better be paying That's more right. attention, See, otherwise Steve, I might shoot you. Dwight's paying attention. Yeah. No, I'm listening. Look at Dwight. I was just uh, resting my eyes. Oh, sure so, thing, man. Sure where thing. Was I? The Daltons. Whatever you right. say. See, there's a reason so many outlaw gangs are made up of brothers. Being a brother is a very sacred thing. It's a bond like no other. What kind of bond? That kind of bond. I got it this time. So did you ever find the damn Daltons? Not yet, but I did find a few of their cousins. You Kansans breed like rabbits. More Smiths or Heimhoffers or who knows what. Did I just shoot that guy's TNT out of his hand? What's more important than family? I bet Ben knows what I'm talking about. Whoa, what? Look at these guys. You can't get me. Which side, which side? Oh yeah. Fast is going in the east. <laughs> Cause that's where I live. I live on the east coast. I'm not from the west. Actually, I was born in the west. I was born as far west as you can get in. Still be on land. Well, I guess Hawaii is still on land. I was just, and I guess Alaska is even further west than uh, California. Well, anyways. I was born in California. A little, little, little fact for you guys. A little, little tiny fact. Probably don't give a shit. Like, who the hell is this guy talking about where he was born? I don't give a shit. Oh my god. That's why pistols are for up close and personal encounters. Rifles are for longer engagements. Right somewhere, standing together against anyone who would threaten them. Oh, I'm running. I'm running. I'm trying That's to get through this. A goddamn steamboat. A steamboat in a swamp? Yeah, Steve, but this wasn't much more than a wreck, really. Yeah, Steve, pay attention. How did steamboat end up in the swamps? 
Yes, it floated off during the flood of 89. <laughs> now, was it a stern wheeler or, or a side wheel? What, what, what's the difference? Does that really make a difference, Steve? No, yeah, seriously, it was Steve. A steamboat. Steve, you know what? Just leave. You don't seem to be into the story that much. Familiar which way? Somewhere up there the Whoops. Were waiting on me. I fell. Familiar in uh old buddy from high school familiar or familiar as in really slept with once. Had a one night stand with. Oops, missed. Sounds like you don't give up too easy. That's the kind of man I am, Ben. I set out to do something. I do it. Surrender just ain't in my nature. Plus, I'm stubborn as hell. Oh, is that where they're getting these shields from? I was thinking were, this was a shield guy. They're getting doors? What kind of weirdos are they? Oh yeah, I think there was a secret thing right there. Stuck. Right about then, much to my relief, the vigilantes finally arrived. Their leader motioned at a cabin in the middle of the top deck, pointing me directly at the Daltons. How did they get through the Daltons' army? Of dogged pursuit. Yeah, how did the Dal how did they get through the Dolan's army without being shot up? Because we just had to go through a whole bunch of Dolan's just to get up here. It's a little fishy. Something to think about. I don't know what she's thinking about it. Like seriously, how do you not see that coming? You're going through a bunch of Dolan's in order to get up to the top of this uh, steamboat. And all of a sudden, as soon as you get to the top, right before the Dolan's, you find a... Uh, Vigilantes instead that are supposed to kill the Dolans. Like but finding my way out just, of a burn in just those an adult. Proved to be quite a challenge. It was a riverboat, right? I mean it's not like it was a goddamn ocean liner. <coughs> well yeah, but I was in Did a you fight. Um you're well, talking about the Titanic. If you ask me, it's too blessed to Oh, poor Leonardo DiCaprio, he's so gonna have anyway, to die. Stupid, Steve. They know That's gonna suck. Doing. They say that the Titanic is unsinkable. Oh, God. But getting back to that steamboat, how'd you get off it, Mr. Green? I took in a lot of smoke. Oh, day. by the way, I was, there's like uh, some Titanic museum, or there's some museum that I went to that had a uh, whole section for the Titanic. <laughs> I was done playing games with those boys. Whoops. It was time to <gasps> this once and for all. Oh yeah. This is another uh, level where you get cracked on some points. Because of combos. I like how everyone slows down when they get killed. They go in slow mo as soon as you as soon as they die. Kind of reminds me of the movie uh, Clock Stoppers. When they're shooting those people with their uh, special paintball guns, they'd all of a sudden slow down and go slow mo. Because they're shooting them with. Uh, what was it? Nitrogen? Or something like that? I don't know. I don't know what it was called. That uh, Lego soft that was in uh, Terminator. Determined to take me down. Confident that this time the odds were on their side. Hey 
got it right. Badass, man. A sad end for those two. If they'd only known that Emmett was still alive despite his wounds. Paroled 14 years later, he moved to California and sold real estate and lived off the legend of that fateful day. And the tragic death of his two brothers. Oh, man. Well, that is uh, it for uh, now. Finally caught up to where I was before, so everything after this is new to me. And it will be new to you. Hopefully, maybe you've played the game already and you just want to see how others did. Maybe you just saw, uh, like, how I sound. Because I got a really sexy voice. Yes, I do. Ah, uh, sexy voice. Soon's all the women. Well, anyways, peace out.